guys, I'm new to this. Uh, here I just have done the oil changes, both engine and transmission, and I'm doing the coolant replacement. Uh, this is a Toyota Avalon XLS. All right. So for this, the air fil the oil uh, engine filter is going to be underneath this right here. You're gonna have to uh, unscrew it to your left and just keep unscrewing it. It's gonna be a little bit tight. And to tighten it, you're gonna have to screw it on and screw it to your right side. Your transmission oil, it will be right here on your right side by the engine oil. Okay, this is your battery. I see your fucking, uh, your turbo. I mean, this is your air filter, air. This is your, this is a V613. Okay, uh, to remove, okay, so, to get under the coolant, you're gonna have to get under here. It's gonna be a, 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 a cap, or I mean, a, a shield or not. And then the, to unscrew it, to unscrew the coolant and remove the air, you're gonna have to get under here and there's gonna be a twist. You're gonna have to twist this out, let it come out through here first a little bit, and then you could turn it all the way out, and it's gonna pull all the way down be aware that it is gonna blast so if I were you I should just uh, remove it through the little pipe let it a little bit come out and then take it out okay uh, to remove your engine or your on your passenger side on the right side it will be right here underneath you're gonna have to unbolt this and then let the oil come out of here everything okay Okay, and your transmission oil is gonna be on the driver's side, on the left side. There's gonna be a bolt underneath here. You're gonna have to put the bolt in, unscrew it to your left. And also, uh, I did not know this, but there is a filter inside of here. So you're gonna have to unbolt all of these on the side with a 10 millimeter. And there, there's gonna be an air filter, I mean an oil filter transmission in here. You're gonna have to remove three bolts uh, two right here and one right here. Be aware of the cable. You're gonna have to take it out, put it back in, you know. So this is your transmission oil, and there's a filter in here. It has to be replaced every 5,000, 10,000 miles or whenever you think it's ready. And right here, you're gonna have to unbolt to remove the engine oil. And this is gonna be your, your fluid for the coolant, okay, to remove. Everything if you want to remove you're gonna have to remove from the bottom. Okay. Okay. Let's go back to the top All right, so This right here is your engine where you check the level This is the level two this is where you put it and this is where I'm about to put uh, My coolant or water which is gonna be water because I don't have that I have to go drive and then go buy a coolant but right now we are going to put our new transmission oil in here be right back all right guys I am about to put the oil inside the transmission oil so what you gotta do is put some tube in here or find a way to put oil in this hole right here yep so I'm gonna put that right there and I'm going to fucking pour some shit hold up I don't know if you can really see it, but what you're gonna do is you're gonna put this right here and you're gonna put your transmission oil. Make sure you use the correct one. Sometimes if it's out of date, they're gonna give you or you're gonna get a, a one that's the same. Oh, this is so fucking oily. Ah, fuck. Oh shit, I'm fucking weak. Oh, what the fuck? Woo, let's go. So I'm about to put transmission oil in here. 
public for everybody to come and pick your cars and take your car pay and buy a car, you know, whatever I got going on, what we gotta do. All right, I'll get back to it. Shit, he just went everywhere. Fucking crap. Oh shit, I did not see that. What? Oh, you know the deal. What you gotta do is put it in here. Keep doing it. What's up everybody, I'm about to show you guys a 1995 Toyota Avalon XLS, okay? It has, this one has 113,000 miles, I just bought it, and I'm about to sell it, asking 4,000 or best offer. It runs beautiful, uh, I just did the oil change for the engine oil, I just did the transmission oil, um... Um, I just flushed, removed the coolant, you know, from the bottom. Everything you gotta do to remove oils is from the bottom. You know, the next thing I gotta do is the power fluid, and then I will be doing the um, this fluid. Right